Hello everyone, this is Sunil here from Asa24 and yeah, welcome to this particular series. We are going to talk about Workday. So what exactly is Workday? Workday is a HCM, right? So let, let me, so this is the tool, all right guys? So the tool that you see in front of you, that's what is called as Workday, right? So you see here, Workday. Now I'm going to explain something about this tool and then this is the first uh, video in the series. I am trying to create a series on Workday. It's a free tutorial so you guys can really enjoy. Right, so let me just uh, put this. So what exactly is HCM and what is the need of HCM and why uh, why Workday is on rise? I mean why is Workday hot indirectly in the market? So let's try to discuss. Uh, just give me one second. I will increase the font. Sorry for this uh, inconvenience right now i think it's clear so so it's a hr it's a, it is something related to the hr kind of stuff or human capital management so it's basically let's say if you're working in a company uh, let's say you're working for something like accenture ibm tcs cts some company right then um, you are an employee so let's say how many employees are there there are somewhere around millions of employees right there are not millions but probably 100k 200k 300k so uh, there are a lot of stuff that needs to be done so there are something like uh, uh, they they all will be on salaries so you need to have the payroll information so the payroll uh, it's something like mandatory pay, payroll information you need to maintain you need to uh, release salaries each and every month so that needs to uh, you need to store that data and release that information that is one thing and then there will be something like uh, times um, like you will be submitting whatever you're doing every day and uh, how many hours you're clocking on that particular thing on that particular work or on let's just say that your um, it's like your uh, attendance kind of thing right so it's the time so the time sheet so time sheet right and uh, okay and uh, let's say some approvals then leaves right approvals uh, leaves if you're taking okay so uh, it's a very common thing that happens in any organization right and there are a lot of let's say financial kind of thing purchases right so financiers then purchase so you do uh, related to purchases and different expenditures like different expenses right finance and expenses so if you have uh, uh, purchased something like as a part and uh, part of your uh, let's say your team work and then that you have claimed right so that needs to be tracked in the software so and that thing and accounts there are a lot of things right so you understood right I mean, you first of all, do you agree that these all things you need a software to manage all this stuff, right? So you just need a software. Now the thing is, uh, what makes Workday special? I mean, what is Workday? Uh, because there are a lot of softwares, uh, HCM softwares that are there in market. You have SAP, Success Factors, that is also in cloud. But there are a lot of other softwares which are uh, uh, which uh, which you need to install on your local machine. But what makes Workday very special is it's completely on cloud. I mean, full cloud. So it's not 99%, it is 100% on cloud. So this is what is Workday. You can see here, this is a tool. And everything related to this, you can manage here, right? So as you can see here, this is the home page. So let me just go and refresh here. I will show you, right? So this is the home page. And um, then you have stuff like learning, uh, onboarding, right so i will i will just try to give a very brief overview of uh, all those things but uh, in this session i'll just make you comfortable on this tool so uh, on this uh, first you, you need to understand like after this video you should be able to answer uh, what exactly is what day eh? so basically all this information we try to store it in this software right and it is completely centralized uh, that makes it very simple and why workday is rising workday is rising because it is a complete cloud solution 100 percent uh, cloud and the main reason is pretty fast okay it, it is very fast compared to sap application and all i can say is workday is really rocking so that's all i can say right now let's see certain things here you can see here 
So I told you, right, it's uh, regarding pay. So let's say um, you can manage many different things, many different information, the timesheet I was talking about. So you can just go here and you can uh, this you can see your the schedule of a, a particular employee or your schedule. So for example, see, uh, and just one more information, try to understand that these tools, whatever tools you're seeing here, now that, dep that depends upon your rights, right? So if you're a manager, you will see different things. If you're a developer, you will see different things. If you're a user, you will see different things. So if you're just a normal user, you, will, you might see only pay information and you will just see pay and certain very basic things, right? Time, pay, these are the things that you will see. Personal information, time, pay. It only three information but that can be configured but normally we have this three information that will be displayed and you can see here workday interface has completely changed and if you see the old style interface that was pretty old now this one uh, one very good thing is you can see the cloud over there so that represents cloud that's pretty cool i would say i mean in uh, 2018 this is really a cool thing and um, uh, pretty good huh so these are the different things right now if i just give you i'll just give you a brief glimpse and in the next session i will be uh, talking about how do you deal with this pay and how do you design uh, this workday uh, interface to accommodate the timings and all those stuff schedules and all those them check in check out all that stuff we'll be talking about but basically on a very high note let's see what are the different things so learning you can create let's say if you want to create a lms kind of stuff a different video set of videos you understand right let's say your company uh, is running uh, let's say you're working in xyz some company and uh, you want to create a video uh, create a tutorial on uh, let's say uh, sap so let's say sap hana or let's just say anything let's just say, uh, let's say data science you want to do it so you just create video stuff so it's kind of an lms stuff you can see here so you can just go here and you can create a new lesson right or you can edit a lesson so new lesson can you see this it's pretty easy pretty simple so you just drop the media file here and it's it's nothing but it's just an lms uh, solution you might be thinking why the hell do we need an lms solution so for those who don't know what's an lms lms is learning management systems learning management system so um it's very simple so you draw drop the files and it will create something it's uh, in short an lms is just like a youtube playlist got it right just a kind just kind of like a youtube playlist so that's what you can create and you can distribute that thing to your employees and other stuff so you can see the videos and other a uh, lot of uh, stuff right so this has been created for your company you need to create that thing so a lot of advanced options also you will see here so if i just go ahead and then uh, the cover image that's nothing but the thumbnail so you have something that in your uh, youtube right thumbnails and title topics description it is pretty simple this one right so unlike other lms solution it's not that complicated it's very simple and then you just go here uh, just discard it uh, then uh, in progress if someone is uh, studying just see here so you have no courses or lessons in progress so actually i have not started anything that's why i can't see but just like a full lms solution for your company right that's see this uh, let me tell you one thing uh, workday is not about lms you got it right it's lms is part of a uh, hcm solutions okay so it's a small part of it so that's why workday is uh, providing support for learning 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 manage, management uh, uh, system right so that's it uh, for this lms now if i go back so this is uh, if you click on this one this takes you to the home page to the home screen right so pretty simple huh? now now let's talk about something as the learning administration if you see so here you can see all the uh, courses that has been created so you just see guys this, this one the course number the title the topic you understood right just like let's say you are uh, you're uh, planning to take let's say workday course so you can also create the same thing here workday course team building pmp um, let's say a sap course um, all these things stuff you can create and you can uh, learning by location so you can just see the overall stats as well so who is learning like on chicago how many people are learning i think this is self-explanatory okay i my job is to just help you guys because you will see workday is very very simple to learn it's very simple to learn 
I mean, it's there's nothing pretty much in there. It's uh, interface stuff. But remember, one very important thing: you can't learn Workday by looking at the screen. I mean, by looking at a video, you can't learn. You need to have this tool, right? So keep the tool, log in in the tool, and whatever I am, uh, I'm telling you, like whatever I'm training, go with that. Just practice, okay? Just see this, all this, see this, just click on this particular stuff, see all that by yourself, then you will learn. Don't think that you're gonna learn just by looking at video. It's not gonna work that way. I know this, okay? Um, so, and uh, the learner engagement, you can see here how many, uh, so is this really important? Yeah, it's really important. I mean, you got, uh, let's say I have somewhere around 200K employees, means two lakh employees. I would like to know, let's say uh, I have launched a course on harassment, uh, let's say harassment on women, so, and I want every one of my employee, every all of my employees to go through that uh, course. So I can go here and check and I can see how many people are doing it and how many engagement, all that stuff I can see, right? And in the graph and you see the course completion status, I can see, okay, how many people have actually completed the course. And you can see here, see uh, the percentage. So can you see this? So 85.2 percentage and all that stuff, right? Not started, 85 dot people have not started. That I would call this as really stupid. <laughs> but anyway, that's it's just an example. So no need to take it seriously. Uh, so this is about the creation of LMS. Now let's say you're uh, on the onboarding side, right? So let's say if your uh, employees are uh, joining. So I, anyway, I will talk about onboarding and all those stuff later. Let's just talk about very basics of uh, this thing. So these two are uh, nothing but the LMS solutions we have talked about. Now, if I talk about the time, right? So this week, how many time you, you can see here, there are two things basically. So uh, sorry, just go back. So there are two things, enter time, view time. So enter time means you are going to clock. So you're going to enter how much you're going to work and uh, stuff like that. So enter time, right? So request absence and the review time, all that stuff you, whatever you want to enter, you, uh, those kind of stuff you can uh, do here. And here it's pretty much <clears throat> view. So it's read only. So you will see your schedule, your time off. And so let's just see my schedule. Uh, so this is my schedule. <laughs> it's not exactly my schedule, but I mean this, uh, is configured in the tool all right this uh, stuff if you have taken any leave or something it will show you you can see the month and you can see day week i mean this is pretty easy right so and then um time clock history right the, you can see one thing which is important you can actually export uh, this thing to your excel sheet so quite a good feature i would say because sometimes it's uh, very important that you export uh, stuff like that and um, a lot of other features, we'll talk about them. Um, then uh, my time off, if I have taken or uh, anything, so that will be planned here. So entering period balance, right? All those uh, uh, stuff is maintained here, who's the manager and which organization and all those stuff, uh, it's here. And um, yeah. So uh, I think that's it guys. I just wanted to make a short video on this one. So this would be the first video of the series. I am creating the next videos in this, in the next videos, I'll be talking in details. How do you create, how do you deal with all that stuff? All this worklet stuff. So we call it as, uh, call them as worklets. So you will learn what exactly is that you, I, I would think you would, you would have already guessed something. So yeah. I mean, that's it. That's it, guys. So thank you very much for uh, watching my boring stuff. And keep you, I mean, uh, stay tuned for uh, the next videos. Thanks, guys. Thank you very much.